what's going on you guys welcome back to another video so i checked out the movie greta on dvd today and i know i'm late because it came to the theaters on march 1st of this year but i still want to give a quick review and recap of the film so greta is based on a suspense um i won't say horror it's leaning more to the suspense side but it's about a young lady named Frances, played by Chloe Moritz. And her mother has passed away, so she's moved to New York. She's new to New York, so she's kind of trying to feel her way through. She has a roommate who goes by the name of Erica. And she works at a restaurant. So while on the subway, she finds a purse. Inside of the purse is an ID who belongs to someone named Greta. She looks up the address on the ID and she finds the address and she takes the purse back to Greta. And as soon as Greta laid eyes on Chloe, you could immediately see the sudden attachment of someone who she don't even know. And so Greta plays a psychopath who pretends that her daughter, Nicola, has moved away to Paris which is not true. So she takes an immediate liking to Francis. She invites her in. She invites her to come over again. She expresses how lonely she is since her daughter's moved away. She finds out that Francis' mother has passed away. So of course that's her cue to move on in and, and try to play the mother role to Francis. Francis also has a father who she don't have a like a close relationship with him, but they do keep in touch. Her father is like a workaholic. And so Francis, she's just trying to deal with, you know, just losing her mother. She has a best friend, they're roommates. And her best friend, she kind of warns her, like, maybe you shouldn't get so close to this lady. You just met her. I mean, they got psychos out there, and she was true. I mean, she was right about it. And so Erica, she's like that 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 friend we have that just keep it real with you no matter what. And so Frances, she just wasn't trying to hear it. Erica was trying to invite her out. Like, you hanging with Greta again tonight instead of hanging out with us. You know, people her age. And she was like, yeah, I don't see nothing wrong with it and blah, blah, blah. And so um, one evening she realized that Greta had like a cabinet full of purses. And inside of the purses was IDs of different young ladies and pinned to the, um, she had like a posted sticker on all of the purses with a young lady name on there and a phone number. And so when Frances found that, she was just shocked to say the least. And so Greta, she realized that Frances was startled by something and she probably knew, she probably knew that she had stumbled across those purses. And, you know, when she was searching for some, she was looking for candles while they were having um, dinner. And so that's when she was like, I don't feel well, I want to go. And I, I know that Gretel picked up on that. And so um, this was kind of the turning point of the movie. So once uh, Frances got away, she told a friend about it, Erica. Erica was like, that is crazy. But I try to tell you that, you know, just something is just not right about somebody who wants to get that close to you so soon and you hardly know each other. And so once um, Greta realized that Frances don't want to have nothing to do with her, she calls and texts her about 50 times a day. She even starts showing up at her job. And during the time that they were friends, Frances went with Greta to go look for a doll because, you know, she played the role like she's a lonely mother. She even poisoned the dog. And we know psychopaths and narcissists, they don't treat animals very well. But the movie is pretty good. It kept me, even though there were some predictable scenes, it still kept me interested enough. Um, I give it a B- minus for the simple fact they played the hell out of those roles. I just kind of wish that the role that Frances played, she would put up a bit of a struggle and be a little more tougher in the role to kind of escape the horror that she was in. So y'all go check out the movie Greta. And um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave your comments down below. And I'll talk to you soon.